Hello friends, join me for a super cute DIY of this little milk bottle that I have. First, we're gonna put on a coat of Slick Stick. You guys, you can get Dixie Belle Slick Stick from Amazon or you can get it from my uh, Poppies and Pansies tab on my link tree. There's several places that you can buy it, you guys. It's pretty easy to get a hold of if you want it, Slick Stick. Okay, we're going to give this a good dry, and then I'm going to add another coat of this. But you always want to make good and sure that the coat, the, your very first coat is good and dry. Because if not, when you go to put on that second coat, it will pull off the, the first coat. So you got to be super duper careful and make sure it's good and dry. If you want to, you could put it on the night before, let it sit and dry while you're in bed. The next morning, get up, you could add another coat and then dry that one, and you should be good to go when you dry the second one. It should not peel it back up off there. And then you can add um, your paint over the top. But this is just the second layer of Slick Stick. I'm making sure it's good and dry, so I'm gonna be drying it for a minute here. And then we're gonna go in with some white paint. This is just white, Waverly White. It is a, a chalk paint. You can use acrylic if you wanna use acrylic. I just choose chalk paint because it covers really, really well. So I'm gonna give that a dry and then we'll add another coat of chalk paint. So at this point, our jar is pretty well covered. So we're gonna give it another good dry just to make sure we get that covered. This print, you guys, is a print from Decoupage Central, which is on my link tree. I love, love, love this print, you guys. It is absolutely adorable. You get two pieces pretty much for the price of one. You get two half sheets, which are different prints. And this is going to be so adorable on here. Anytime you go to take your print around a bottle or around uh, a surface that's not exactly flat, you want to put little notches in it. So I'm putting notches in it with my scissors so that it will lay flat against the bottle instead of getting all crinkled up and have all kinds of uh, wrinkles in it. I don't care for wrinkles, so I try my best not to get them. So now we're just going to throw a few pieces of torn material in here into my little mini Bodabra. And we're just going to add different pieces of extra pieces of uh, ribbon that I've cut up that I've had for quite some time. I, sh I save all of my extra pieces and we're just gonna use it to make a small bowl. Bow, not bowl. <laughs> I'm gonna give that a good tie. And we're going to put this around the neck of the bottle. You guys, I can do farmhouse. I can do just, I can pretty much do any type of craft it's just that um, I've got to have the right items or things that look right to me because if I don't have, I just really don't want to do them. I added the cotton in here. I took the cotton out, you guys. I did not like the way it looked. I put it in these pictures, as you can see. I put uh, these florals in here and it looks so much better than what it, what it did with the cotton. I love these. I hope you guys enjoyed this. And if you are not following your Kindle blessings, give us a follow. Come hang out with us. I hope you guys have a blessed day. Take care of yourselves.